as a woman in for example a uh, very religious country is going to be m more likely to be a virgin but like i can't talk about the dating culture in ethiopia the usa is a large country so we can talk we can talk about the usa and a lot of these concepts probably expand to the rest the rest of the western world so Oh, well, I'm not from the Western world, so I'm sorry I don't get your rules. But so I'm just curious. So you object to me saying that most adult, most, most women say between the ages of 18 or 19 are not virgins? You, yeah, not you sure disagree with that. that? Yes. You think um, it's more than 50% of women who are yes. 19 are virgins? That's what I'm thinking. Like, uh, in the whole world. You've been here for a year? Yes. Have you seen the partying that goes on in <laughs> yes, Santa it's just Barbara? This town. Like, it's just this town. It's just oh no! This town. I mean, no? oh no! I live in Orange County. I live like, uh, well, like I'm from Orange County, and it's I can like definitely say, most of the girls have definitely lost it, like 18, 19, or before. Well, we'll go around the panel really quick. Um, what age did everyone lose their virginity? Late sixteen. Late sixteen. You're a virgin. Sixteen. Shania. Late twenty-four. What? Oh, that's new. Okay, maybe that explains... <laughs> were you in, like, a cult or something for... <laughs> nope. Um, 24. I just, like I said, this the current relationship I'm in um, is the first relationship I've been in. Um, and, you know, I just wanted to be super comfortable with whoever I decided to sleep with. But they didn't know I was a virgin. Wait, so the, the person you're currently seeing... Yes. He... He's the one that took your virginity. No. Oh, okay. I see. <laughs> and you? Still there. Wait, you're still a virgin? Yeah. Oh, wait. I thought you had a boyfriend for like a year and a half. No, I said or, eight months. Oh, eight months. That was middle school, so that means... Uh, yeah, nothing. okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, that doesn't even really count as a relationship, I reckon. Yeah. Right? Middle school, I mean. But, uh, okay, so you're still a virgin. Mm-hmm. No stereotype. Well, no, I'm not stereotyping, but, um, so, and just a reminder, so you're 19 or 18, 18 and you're 19. Okay. So you guys are outliers. I'm going to say it. Fact of the matter is, and I, I don't have an expectation that a girl I'm seeing is a virgin. If she is great, that's cool. Bonus points. But, um, in today's day and age, most guys are not expecting a girl to be a virgin mm -hmm. the first time they hook up so wait but do you think you will expect oh uh, no do you think the girl you date will expect you to be a virgin why are you expecting mm -hmm. that wait what like the girl you date do you think they will like expect you to be a virgin no i, I think and i think most women probably don't want their partner to be a virgin most women would probably want their partner to be uh, more sexually experienced most women okay. do you let me ask well so you're a virgin do you want to date a guy who's a virgin i don't mind there's nothing wrong with that by the way if you do but no i don't mind you don't care if, yeah, don't if the care. guy is not okay. a virgin okay what about you Lori? i don't really care and i will not really want to know before like we get there you wouldn't want to know yeah like before we actually get there and talking about his uh, former sexual experience is sure mm. well I don't think it's always a great idea to go into detail about former sexual experiences but even if it, you, you wouldn't even want to know if he had had sex before like if he brought it up himself uh, then I'll be like okay with it but I don't ask okay got it okay so this is news to me that <laughs> You're also a virgin. So um, just curious, are you waiting for marriage? Are, are you waiting for a long-term relationship? Are you just kind of, you're ready to lose it? You just want to meet the right guy, but you're ready to go? Uh, no, I'm waiting for a long-term relationship. Long-term relationship. Okay, cool, cool. Hey, I mean, it's pretty rare. Um, so good times. I think, anyways. Um, but so you objected to my characterization that most women, 18 to 19 year old women are not virgins.
I, unfortunately, I don't know. There's probably been some studies on the average age at which most people lose their virginity, but um, I would suspect that uh, the majority of people lose their virginity by 18 or 19. Do you, you, you think it's maybe a bit older, or what do you think on that? Um, well, based on the information I get from the table, I guess uh, most of the girls lost their virginity before uh, the turn it, it, to adulthood, but um, I, I respect it. Like, there's nothing wrong with it. So maybe I'm wrong. But you told me to open my eyes. <laughs> yeah, because uh, maybe look at India, China, Korea, and Middle East. Hmm. Like, there are other countries. Okay. Well, I, I don't anticipate doing any dating in Qatar anytime soon, but um, <laughs> I'm trying to think here. Uh, I mean, you both are from China. We, yeah. could, we could talk a bit about that. Is virginity something that's valued in China? Our parents just don't allow us dating until college. Oh, my parents don't allow me to date in college. <laughs> would your <laughs> Would your parents mm -hmm. if they found out that you is premarital sex like frowned upon in China? So having sex before marriage, is that frowned upon in China? It's not like a deal breaker, but some family um they think that is a really like severe situation. Okay. 